Well, it's a Saturday night And I think I'm feeling alright Oh, that's nice. Oh, that's a nice chord. Oh, yeah, that gets applause. What a good chord. Whoa, 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 whoa. Because it's a Saturday. Where does it resolve? E flat. Why? It's an E flat. Whoa, yeah, yeah. It's a Saturday. Whoa, whoa, yeah. They use that chord a lot in, uh, in like, sitcoms and stuff, right? Hi. Hi, everybody. How's it going? What's happening? We So we're, we're trying a brand new computer tonight. Uh, we, we, we've, tried, we, we've really tried to iron out all all potential uh, pitfalls. And as I can see, we're, we're already uh, we're, <laughs> I, I have just test, tested the Internet speed. We are looking a, a little a little on the glitchy side. Uh, we're, we're, we're just going to do we're just doing the best we can here. We've graduated. We've, we've come a long way from uh, River we have Internet. zero people. Yeah, well, so, I'll get here eventually. Uh, oh, okay, I mean, I can play a tune while we're waiting. <laughs> I mean, or we could just go away. It's fine. <laughs> Carrie's here. Hello, Carrie. <laughs> Hi. Hello, Carrie Atwood. I'm just going to write a, uh, it, it, it's like the intro to a uh, an 80s uh, sitcom. Sometimes you know. Stitching up a thing. She's stitching up a thing because, of course, she is the, the, the leather seamstress, as we know. Award-winning. Award-winning, oh, by the way. Like, yeah, oh, okay. So that sounds like it's working. So the, the sound is good. The sound is good, right? Still a little glitchy on the uh, on the feed, but the sound is good. Well, I'm on the regular network, so... D do we sound okay? Do we sound okay? Are we, yeah, <laughs> we going to... A vote of confidence? Yeah. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Hi. Welcome. It is Saturday night uh, getting started here on the show in, in just just a couple of moments. Uh, and uh, yeah, we <laughs> I had this whole notebook full of things that we were going to talk about here. And uh, I have, of course, left them in the other room. Oh, let me get that for you. Yeah. So there you go. We, we rehearse. <clears throat> How's everyone doing? How's oh, hi, David. David Seltzer's <clears throat> here. What's up, brother? How are you? We rehearse this show. Oh, boy. Boy, oh, boy, do we rehearse. How is everybody doing uh, uh, these days? We, we were just observing the fact that, that pretty much the pandemic seems to be over by most people's lights. Kathy Brown is here. Uh, and yet, um, there, there are certain things that we wish that you could still maintain perhaps, uh, from, from the pre from the, 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 during pandemic times, um, not least of which is, oh, thank you so much. Um, not barfing up a lung in public, if what I'm right. No, I know I'm probably the last person wearing a mask in the grocery store. And that's store. fine. That's fine. That's, that's fine. fine. I'll, I'll take that stigma, but would it be okay if the woman next to me in the cheese yeah. section wasn't like, <coughs> like right, right, right. Fully, no matter, like, just, just coughing an no, orb terrible. of droplets for me to walk into. I'm right. like, uh, I'm pretty sure this not not to do with the pandemic. It it would be good if this was always gross. We've learned too wrong. much. We've learned way and way too much. So yeah. If we could not, but you know, it's now it's like a stigma. I don't want to say anything to her, right? Because it's okay to be out there coughing how it did, up now. How did this happen? Now all of a sudden, like, we, you know, we're the asshole. For right? I, you cannot just I don't want to go like, can you co like, cover your, that? That's bad. Even yeah. if you don't have COVID, whatever you have sounds bad. It does sound bad. Yeah. Hello, my mom. tuberculosis? Because that's worse than keep, COVID. Keep it at home, really. Okay. Yeah. TB is, yeah. TB is still, still worse. Uh, Kathy says, uh, oh, Kathy, well, we're, the big emotional hug for you, uh, my friend. We are wrapping our arms around you tonight. Uh, uh, whatever it is that, that you have going on, we, uh, we, we, we love you. Oh, oh, good. You, you know, oh, you know hi, that we Kyrie. love you. Hello, she, Kyrie. It's 85. Oh, my God. Well, that's, oh, no. that's because you live in a hot place, and I believe in it is yeah, in the desert. Yeah, where the it tends day to be after hot, high school which, graduation. I got in my car and left the desert forever. <laughs> <And then laughs> I did. Never to return. I or was like. Zipped away. Bye. 
saying? Exactly. Yeah. Because I just could not handle the weather. I was sad all the time. I so yeah, and in fact, <laughs> now dog on it. I had written this down. Does anybody uh, recall? Very recently, there was an article in <laughs> Channel Time, probably, uh, that talked about how there's an actual term for what Loro has, which is the opposite of seasonal affective disorder. It is you, you get is bummed out when it's seasonal affective disorder sunny. only when it's winter. Like, I don't why know. can't I don't my know. thing be a thing? It's called reverse sad, I think. Yeah, the, it's, it's when there, you there's... get sad when it's sunny exactly. out. There, there is but... a term for it. No, I'm gonna know what it is. Hello, <laughs> Heather Coates. How are you? <laughs> I'm gonna turn you all into goths eventually. Pretty much, okay, yeah. Just... Well, we we wear plenty of black here, yeah. so we're we're we're, we're oh. like your goth starter kit here. Ki Christina is here. becoming a goth. She's like, I hate summer now because of you. Oh <laughs> like, no! Oh, did, did you she used to like summer? <laughs> did yeah. you used to? Because really, we don't. She misses the glue. We don't want to ruin anybody's vibe. Uh, my mom says you're not the defective ones, and I think that's, that's exactly right. right. Yeah. So. Thanks. She's the internet. She's the mom of the internet. My mom. My like, mother you're is. You're okay. You're okay. Every place my mom goes, every yeah. group that she is a part of, she is the den mother of it. She so is. my mother is officially the den mother of the only show uh, with dildo jokes. Thank oh, you very okay. much. That's my mom. Yeah. So, so last. So we're on a new computer. Well, we're on a new old computer. It's an old computer. Yeah. yeah we're trying to because, figure this uh, out. Because yeah. last week we totally that computer just screwed the whole. Putin, it right? did, and then we sent it basically like underwater robots. Yeah. Apparently, was, we, was my we sound okay now. Uh, my understanding. <laughs> we sound okay now. I, I tested this. I tested this thing uh, before. Oh, wait. Uh, Carrie says she used to love the heat in the sun, but now that she's a more mature woman, she cannot yeah. tolerate the heat any longer. Okay. Well. Yeah. No, we were at the saying. state fair, like, water and to sit down. Like, mm -hmm. we, can't, we can't handle it. Did you guys hear that Carrie won? A blue ribbon for her leather crafting. Oh my goodness, amazing. Yeah, we showed the award. Well, okay, I don't know if you guys caught the terrible tech filled error, a tech yeah, error filled show last week. Glitch extravaganza was, uh, yeah, is what it was. It was quite yeah. something. No. Quite. And anyway, we, we, we did show it. And if I can uh, dig that yeah. photos up, we'll, we'll show it again. So now, now listen. Did, hello, my dad. How's it going, dude? So, does it ever happen to you? And, and I know that the answer is yes. So, just get ready to, to to nod your head in agreement with with this sentiment. When you just want to do one thing, and the next thing you know, it's six months later, <laughs> right? So, case in point, this is adult life. This right? is adult. Like life. you yeah. start a thing, you're just like, I no. just want this one thing. Like today, right. you were trying to plug something in. I have. So, in order, for, you just want to do one thing, right? In order for us Everything's to hard. Pr provide this fine, fine broadcast that we're, we're providing for you this evening, I had to switch to an older computer, which required plugging in a couple more. That I really, just trying to do one thing. Exactly. Right. Just trying to do one thing. Just trying to show up, have some laughs. I have no Can earthly you? idea why plugs are not uniform size, and I certainly <laughs> have no idea why they don't make plugs when you have like a power strip spaced further apart because all these goddamn I guess they're called wall warts. You know what I'm talking about? The ones that the, the, the plugs that do like the the prong is like this, and the plug is like this, and it's like mm, okay, thank you. That's great use of space. Very uh, ergonomic. Uh, so anyway, so I'm basically wall warts. I'm, is this the thing? Wall warts, yeah, it's like if I could pull one up, I would show you. But it's basically the plug that, you know, the, the prong is like so, and then the rest of the plug is like that. You know what I I'm get, talking about? I, yeah, I it's called a wall wart. Yeah. And so there have been numerous ways to kind of work around this whole thing. Blah, blah, blah. Doesn't fucking matter. I spent 20 <laughs> minutes trying to plug in one thing. Just moving things. Here, just, it was like a game of Tetris on a power strip is what I had. Hmm. I have one. Earlier Hit this me. year, mm -hmm. we were like, hey, you know what would be cool is if the grass in the front yard wasn't brown for four months of spring and summer. Right. And right. By, by the way, before you get into this story, I just have to say that Heather Coach, she has started us off early. She says that her plug is uh, is, is universal. There you go. That's what she said. Yeah, sorry. Okay. I'm sorry. Okay. I just, nice, I, nice it's, event, a, it's a tick. You just yeah. have to get mm -hmm. it. Out Heather's already system. playing the game. Sorry. Off to a great sorry. start. We've got we plenty have of cards. cards. Oh, yeah. We have cards. Oh, we, oh, we just, have cards. We'll get to it in just, just a second uh, here. Trying to make sure that, because last week, here's what happened. Here's what happened. We jumped in too early. Yeah. We didn't know that we were tech glitchy, and then yeah. the whole thing crashed and burned. Yeah, exactly. And then so, we just walked away so we wouldn't, like, destroy any of the studio. It was burning down. I mean, the, the whole thing was, was like, a, basically a, a yeah. fire alarm fire. And, and then we tried to restart, and everyone's like, you still sound like robots. And we're like, look at that, bro. Yeah, exactly. And then yeah, we went crazy. It wasn't, no. wasn't fun for anybody involved. Tonight we're bringing the fun, though. Fun is back. <laughs> fun is back here tonight on the Angie only show. Fuzz will not be joining us there after Damn. dinner God, with shame. her dad. Yeah. Norm. <laughs> no. So anyway, uh, you, you, we want the grass to be green. 
You yeah. want green grass, yeah. right? That, that tends to be so, brown, bad, green, good. Yeah. So first, and so, and so this brings up a whole thing where I think this is why Eric Atwood, this is his whole job, right? Sure. Where people go, well, that's not that hard. And mm -hmm. then they figure out how hard it is. And so they have to hire him. And yeah, he they, has to like <laughs> bail them out of their, yeah. you know, like my vision is this. And he's like, yeah, that's not as easy as you think it is. Yeah. So uh, basically, uh, took up this project where I was trying to figure out why the homeowners before us didn't have like sprinklers installed in the front yard, sure. right? I was like, yeah. maybe there are sprinklers. So I, are. I spent like weeks trying to figure out all the sprinkler zones, like an old, the old white lady that I am. I made all these notes about sprinkler zones. <laughs> that, that escalated quickly. Yeah, but yes, I, but I please am. continue. Yeah. Then I was like, all right, all right, I'm missing one zone. So then I tried to hire someone and someone ghosted me and I'm like, well, don't you want, work? I don't understand you, whatever. Yeah. Like, don't you have a company that provides this service sure. then finally i bring in a guy get a guy to show up and he's gonna be much and like, fine yep. fine just want sprinklers yep. i just want green grass so then he installs the sprinkler and this takes like weeks yep. then then he installs the sprinklers and goes uh did you want me to fix that grass for you it's gonna be like an additional two thousand dollars and i'm like what are you talking about two thousand dollars i, guess, I have youtube i'll fix the grass fix the myself so then I tried to fix the grass and then a week or so went by and I need some adjustments to the sprinklers. So I called the irrigation guy and he showed up and he goes, <laughs> that's a good try. You're going to mm -hmm. need to kill the moss first underneath. And I'm like, oh boy, he's right. Like I should have hired him, but now I'm too stubborn but to now, give up. Right now so, at this point, you're way, way too invested. So then so, I'm yeah. like, okay, I get some grass to grow. And once it grows, I realize, uh-oh. The lawn needs to be extended by four inches. <laughs> it needs to be four inches wider. Yeah, yeah. But I'm talking about four inches by 300 feet. So it's, yeah, if, if you can see, it's it's basically like the country of Chile, if, if you know <laughs> your geography. So, yeah. so every so now we have like posts and a string and like oh boy. it's much more it's complicated. A project. And this project has been going on for three months. <laughs> it's, it is a project. It, it, and remember, all I wanted was green grass. Okay, that, yeah. that rant over. Rant over and, 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 and well. Well executed, very well executed, <laughs> Rand. By, uh, by the way, uh, before we uh, get into this, um, th th we may be two of the last people on Earth. Do you guys have anything like that where you started something and then you're like, uh-oh, this is much harder than I thought? It turns out to be way, way harder than you think. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. you just like, you think, oh, this is going to be easy. Right, it's just this one thing, and then the next thing you know, you're ordering specialty parts from China, yeah. and it's like, yeah. This and then you're you're uh, you're on your hands and knees in the driveway, like of lining up a line of rocks so that you can extend the driveway four inches. Eric says he likes country chili. Do we have any idea what that's a reference to? <laughs> oh, Christine says having, having a family. family. Yeah, it's just like, it sounds what? It's just, good. Just gonna be this it little thing. We're just like gonna have a, we're gonna have a family. Yeah. That's what we're gonna do. Parenting. Yeah. Eric. Dot. Dot. Yeah. Dot. Yeah. Okay. Every every pre well, that's Eric. I don't know if we're here today. When I was putting rocks in the driveway, yeah. I was thinking this is Eric's whole job. Oh yeah. People think how hard could that be? I'm just gonna do it. And then you cut it, and you're like, you're yeah. dumb. But you don't, don't say, say that, that because you uh, want to make some yeah. money uh, off the situation. By the way, uh, Laura and I might be the final people on the planet to have never ingested a pumpkin spice latte. Well, all that changed today. <laughs> she brings home a uh, pumpkin spice latte. Um, it, it, they're really fucking sweet. I, Am I, I right? Like, like is, is anybody into these? Honest I to God, to need an insulin sh shot sweet. Yeah. Right? No. I mean, it's really pumpkin-y? Very pumpkin-y. Yeah. I, I think it would be the, the way to describe <clears throat> it. And, and, and boy, oh boy, just like makes your, your cheeks kind of hurt a little bit. I should have taken note that I don't really like pumpkin all that much. So there like, you go. Uh, yeah. You know? Well, you, for, for somebody who makes pumpkin muffins. I like pumpkin chocolate chip muffins, right? Mm -hmm. That has other spices in it. It just tasted like a piece of pumpkin pie in a cup. Kathy right. says you. <laughs> I like that. Very nice. I don't Kathy know. says you have to get them half sweet. Okay. All right. Oh, is that a thing? Duly noted. Uh, yeah. That was that was a lot. All those me. drinks, uh, yeah, are, are, are tooth decay sweet. That is mm -hmm. absolutely right. You see those bottles yeah. of syrups that they have on the wall there, and I'm like, Jesus H Christ! What? That do, was what a are lot. The, the, those are literally just like like pancreas killers up there. Am I right? That's too much. Yeah, way Did too you much. Like it. 
I liked it fine, I guess. I wouldn't get it again. It reminded me of how <clears throat> when Starbucks first started uh, issuing, making their uh, their their holiday themed uh, drinks, the one thing that I got was the uh, the eggnog latte. Oh, I don't like that one. And I scrambled uh, eggs immediately. <clears throat> if you steam eggnog, like it tastes like cooked egg. Yeah, <laughs> so I don't like it's that like at all. it's like scrambled eggs in a cup, which you know, not bad, except for then all of the sugar. And uh, who doesn't like a, a heap and dollop of nutmeg with their scrambled <laughs> eggs? Right. I don't like the eggnog. I don't like eggnog of any kind because right, right. it makes me uh, think in my mind like I'm drinking raw eggs. Yeah, it well, just, sure. it, it's so gross to me. I'm like, oh, mentally, I can't handle this. I don't know what the word nog means. Anybody have any ideas on that <laughs> one without Googling? Just anybody off the top of your head? Any idea what the what derivation of the word nog was supposed to mean? Is it the sound that you make when you I, I, I have no. No earthly clue. Um, it's gotta be like a sweet name. Or something. I, I, yeah, I, I, I would imagine. Sh so, by the way, I'm professionally sleeping now. Um, I have. Oh, you switched medication. I've switched to this stupid fucking medication yeah. I've been taking for my restless leg. I, I, I think, I think I have officially uh, I switched off of it, and uh, it's certainly, certainly proving to be the reason why I've not slept well in like in three, three fucking years. years. Yeah. Oh my god. And oh now my you're god. Like, just sleep it. You're not. You're narcoleptic. My, listen, Dad. I'm gonna give you a for your money in the sleeping department if this thing keeps up. So let's have a show, shall we? Yes, here we go. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> We're so glad you didn't give up on us. Yeah, yeah. We are back. We are back. Yes, indeed. Uh, oh, I can't really see the comments. Yeah, well. No. I'm troubleshooting that. Hello. Nog might mean noggin. It might mean, yeah, egg for your noggin. That that could okay. absolutely be right. All right. Uh, so, so listen, um, we are, we're just about to dip in here. I'm very, very excited about uh, this, this particular set of cards, I think. I wrote them two weeks ago. <laughs> I was supposed to play in the middle these of the night. last week. Yeah. I, I wrote these in the middle of the night. Let's uh, let, let's see how these guys fly. Uh, uh, I can't pull this up, though. What am I going to? Mm. Okay, maybe I can hotspot off my phone. Oh, that's a good idea. Look at me. Mm. Work around. Oh boy, always, always okay, a work around. Talk amongst yourselves while I hook this up. Raw eggs, uh, milk, raw eggs, vanilla, cinnamon, sugar, and nutmeg all mixed in a glass, so it is raw eggs apparently. So there you go. I don't know. But the, even the eggnog latte doesn't seem like it could be raw eggs. Well, it though, wouldn't right? be at that point. Is Starbucks you've... serving that? Oh, that sounds so unsanitary. Mm -mm. King Charles III is on the nog. Oh, I like that. That's that's <laughs> funny. Nice and then. Uh, a nog is a half a brain. A noggin is the full Monty. Okay, I like this. This, okay. this. this is phenomenal. You people are full of wit and, and whimsy and wisdom tonight. Keep it. Keep it. Uh, don't leave it in the green room, as they say. As we Keep begin, the same energy. As we begin tonight's game, nothing's been funny ever since blank. Nothing has been funny ever since blank. And boy, is it a long list. <laughs> 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 Am I right? Over the last couple of years? Holy cow. Nothing has been. You snug it. Do you want some nugget? I didn't even need to know that, that was Kerry who said the comment uh, before I, I went and looked at it. Okay. Nothing has been I think funny I'm ever on since the blank. Now. The queen died. Okay, we got two. The queen Aww. died. Yeah, that is true. Humor died. With QE2. What was it with the people collapsing at Queen Elizabeth's funeral? I don't there was know. a guard that collapsed and then somebody well, else. They're famously not supposed to collapse. Is, I, I, is, is I that, don't know. Is that a fact? I, I, I did not hear about this. There, there were people collapsing. Maybe because maybe because they were probably forced to stand in line for like 24 hours. Probably. Uh, in order to, to actually get a, a piece of the action. Get a, get a piece of the Queen is dead action. I, that, that sounded really tacky. Didn't it? Trump. Nothing has been funny since Trump. That is absolutely <laughs> true. Heather. <laughs> Uh, my dad is laughing his ass off over that. Uh, Gen X uh, 50 admin cited it was funny. It is true. And they are the final arbiter, arbiter on everything. Cosby said the darndest thing. Kathy, yeah. that is a phenomenal, That's phenomenal the best callback. Answer. That's one yeah. of the yeah. best callbacks. The best answer. callbacks ever, probably. Yeah. Uh, okay. Here, I wrote it. Did, Thank can you, you see it? Charles took... Ch oh, Kathy. Oh, Charles is oh, in charge. Charles. Is, oh, my goodness. I think Kathy just won this round. Charles in charge. Uh, okay, Kathy, nicely done. Ka Kathy's off to a, to a great start here. Uh, let's see. Eric cut his long hair. You did have long hair like your son at one point, like like Sirius. Did you not? I believe. Yeah. Mm. I've seen Eric with his spiky blonde do, uh, which seemed very punk rock at the time. Or very like uh, X Games, maybe. Yeah. Eric, I, X, oh yeah. yeah that, that, that did you have sp like bleached spiky, hair, like spiky a blonde hair? Blink 182 guy? Something like that, yeah. Yeah, like a skateboarder. <laughs> My mom says, give Kathy all the prizes. Well, Kathy's off to a great start to achieving uh, exactly that. She uh, just won the first round. Um, I got nothing going on. Let's get loaded in blank. All right, you guys. I got nothing going on. 
we got a whole evening ahead of us. Let's just get loaded in blank. We are finally watching Stranger Things. Finally, finally, finally. <laughs> We're the Good last ones. Christ, I can't believe that it has taken us this long. We uh, watch, watch like one TV show once a week. Basically, yeah. Like it's going to take us forever. We're, we're, well, we're on the last episode next week, so... So, yeah, unless, of course, we decide to sign off tonight and watch it, which we might do. No, that can't happen. You don't think? No, because then we'd be binge watching. We would actually be binge watching a show, which we have not done in forever. I like ever since we got kind of involved in our projects. Right? Yeah, exactly. Then we just we don't do uh, we, we, we don't do things like watching television anymore. Why not? Do you well, remember the days? I had this notion that I was going to write all these books and do all these things and by have. my big birthday. But now it's like I can't. Can't do anything but work like you have done yeah. all those things I've you've done, done all the things well i have three more months i mean i have four more months basically till my birthday so okay all right so that's the deadline yeah. mm -hmm. and yeah. i have three books to go <laughs> kathy says i got nothing going on let's get loaded and kick people out of the gen x group yes indeed oh boy there is nothing nothing more satisfying than kicking somebody out of that group i swear to god it is just what the most glorious thing. What is wrong with people? Uh, that's exactly right. That, that, that so, our, I don't our generation know. If, is if full of a holes. Group, we yeah. have this group, and it's yeah. grown to like forty-four thousand people. Actually, or it's almost fifty thousand oh, people. Oh, okay. Believe. And yeah. now, like, that's a lot of people. Oh yeah. So now, like, people act so weird and yeah. crazy. We're just always kicking people out. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. No, it's and, and it's so satisfying. Uh, write inspiring messages on this book. Talk, oh, Christy. That, that is such a Christine answer. Call oh. Bale's bail bond. A good frog gigging. Fall asleep. Spark up another one, says David. Summon Sleep. my ex from the seventh level. <laughs> oh. If you say his name three times. Exactly, yeah. He's, he's like Beetlejuice. Yeah. Uh, Christina is the relevancy decider. That is her. <laughs> she gets to decide if a, if a post on the Gen X group is relevant or not. And then if it isn't, why it's... It's out of there. Eric made me laugh out loud with, with rock the driveway. <laughs> <laughs> he also said ballroom dance. So. Rock the driveway. Get I'll a new fish. It. Oh, oh, Eric is Eric has <gasps> come to play. I almost did last night. Eric has come to play. Okay. Yeah. Last night, I saw this uh, thing go by on a free group where someone was like, I need to get rid of some koi fish. And I'm yeah, like, yeah. oh, God, we're going to get some more fish. Uh -huh. I can just yeah. feel it. Yeah, it, is, it. It is the cry of the fish owner. We're fish people now. I don't yeah. know why. I don't know how, how it happened. It just happened. You trained the indoor fish to be very surly and rude. I didn't. I it, think it, you should tell them about This what is the you craziest did. thing. So one of our <laughs> fish, Ronnie, uh, who was named after the twins in uh, Rushmore, Ronnie and Donnie. He's and a then violent Donnie, fish. Donnie died. He's and so now it's just, all the time. just Ronnie. You walk by the tank and he's like banging it in against it. Uh, we can't figure out what he's doing. He's making some I think he's, like, he's like bang, aggressively splashing bang. the top of it. it. Like, give me food. Give me food. And I'm like, you get nothing if you act like that. They are that. the hungry goddamn fish I have ever seen. Unfucking believable. So anyway, yeah, we let's get loaded and drive to drive the Texas. Come on over. Sure. See you in a bit. See you in a bit. See you in a bit. There has never been a better time to buy blank. There is never. By, by the way, having a correction. Those of you who follow such things, having a big fat correction right now. Uh, S and P down 19 points off the year. Woo wee. Buy in time. Not Never. supposed to look at that. No, no, no. I, I, I try not to, but you can't. You, you, you see headlines go by. Is There's, now a good time to sell off my Tesla stock because I hate Elon Musk. I hate that guy. No, no. In fact, now would be a good time to buy some fucking Tesla stock. I'm never doing that. There's again. never been a better time to buy Nog. <laughs> a politician, <laughs> says Christina. Uh, we're on. Ariel, uh, we're off to a fabulous start. That's Viagra. Good. Yep. Off to a fabulous Nog. start. Nog. Nog. There's never been a better time to buy Viagra. Mm-hmm. Mm. The more you I saw know. some guy on the Gen X group talk about how he puts it in a, a Pez dispenser. Har, har, har. Right? Yeah. Just a little blue blue pills. He was a dick, though. So I eventually kicked him out. <laughs> he turned out to be... People he was are the one, so funny until they're not. He was the one who then said in a later comment, he's like, bros, what is up, you know, what, I, he's something along the lines of, what is up with all these menopausal women? I it was something along along the lines of, I wish I could just be Click. PMS again. I'm like, you're oh, gone. Go, go you're, you're gone. You're gone. And then people Later. will come back and be like, why am I kicked out of the group? You're like, mm, 
for being you. For I being do, you, sir. Are you or really madam. wondering? You yeah, did something. If you have Also, fans. it's a free group. Go find another free Go group fuck to be off a to another group. Like exactly. A, there are lots of places to be. Uh, why are you yeah. why are you crying? Yeah, Come exactly. On. There's never been a better time to buy votes, uh midget street waters, uh, a burial plot, a high speed internet. Yes, Carrie, I know. It's <laughs> w- listen, I I could show you the speed test right now and then you, you, you would see we, we indeed have a uh, high speed going on here. For some reason, glitchy as fuck. Uh, fake identities to vote multiple times. Uh, my loyalties is Kathy. Taco Bell. Uh, a bigger pant size. Uh, let's see, Kathy dies in the end. Uh, uh, classified documents. Yes, yes. Always. A- apparently a-, a real buyer's market right now. Uh, if, 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 if you're looking for that sort of thing. Tito's. Trump's failed social media company. A bigger pant size. Jim a beer. These are fantastic. What did he think was going to happen when he left the White House with classified documents? Mm-hmm. What do you think? No, he just he doesn't think is about these things. Is this a publicity stunt? Wants. Is the past four years a publicity stunt? Five I, I, years? I, I, honest to God, I'm, I, I'm afraid the entire country is a publicity stunt right now. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck is happening. Uh, let, let's see. Uh, we had so many funny uh, answers. I'm just going to have to go with the one that made me laugh uh, first, uh, and that was Christina with a politician. I liked that very much. Very, very nice. Yeah. Better, never a better time than to buy a politician than right now. <laughs> okay, so we were just talking about things that we wish that people would stop doing in public, um, <laughs> right? Uh, around, you know, COVID uh, etiquette and, and such. But have you been to a gym lately? You probably haven't. It's been, oh, time for you to get the beer out of the freezer. Oh, is it yeah. time for you to no. go to bed? Oh. No. Good night. Yeah. Well, not okay. everybody drives safe. Then. Okay. <laughs> a vowel, says Eric. The Eric 18 inch panties. Oh, that's good. That's that, gross. That, that, that gets a co- that, that that actually gets a commendation though for my dad okay. for that. 18 inch panties. Very very funny. A uh, gym etiquette. Never blank in the locker room. Just don't do it. So th- th- those of you who have been uh, to gym locker rooms know that uh, there is all sorts of wrong comportment in 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 a gym. Guys walking around. <clears throat> I do believe that you used to go to a gym in L.A. where guys would shave their balls over the sink. That was the gym I quit, and that was the reason why. <laughs> it was a, I don't mind telling you, it was 24-Hour Fitness in Santa Monica. Never become a member at 24-Hour Fitness in, in, in Santa Monica because they allow people, first of all, Band-Aids in the shower drains. Not oh just God. Band-Aids, condoms. Oh, like, God. Like gross stuff oh, in the shower. Oh, just gross stuff in the shower. But and they then do allow people to uh, shave their hairy balls. Leg up on the <laughs> sink and just... just that was more town. than once, right? Wow. More than God. one guy. It was horrifying. <laughs> I mean, it was one of those things that still haunts me in my dreams. I'm like, Jesus, I did not have to see there was that. There's also the guy, the old guy with the long hanging always, balls. Always, 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 always. There's always just one. talking in the gym. There's right? always one guy who he'll go out into the you know into to the main workout area and maybe do a set <laughs> like but mostly <laughs> just standing around uh, as as i think uh, my my uh, old uh oaky relatives used to say fucking the dog i believe was what the expression was just standing around saying nothing i just, think you're gonna get canceled just got canceled good night everybody just got canceled for that anyway uh but standing around doing absolutely nothing and then Going into the locker room, <laughs> stripping fully naked, like <laughs> liver spots and all, and horrifying people with his dangly, dangly nutsack. Oh, Jesus H. Christ. It was Did he then shave those balls? Horrifying. I don't know. I don't think there was... When you get to a certain age, I don't think you grow any more pubic hair. It was just horrifying. <laughs> Plus, there was there was this one guy, this one old guy, whose balls had basically... Over- his, you know, his uh, kingmaker, as it were, and it was just, it was just disappeared. It was just, he was, he'd become an innie, is what I mean to say. It was, it was really, really was awful. That, uh, the, was that the guy you called low balls? No, that low balls, low balls. Yeah, that's just a whole different, like that's just a hanging balls guy. Yeah, yeah. There's, uh, you, you just see things about people in a gym locker room that you just don't want to, you, you don't want to see any of that stuff. Okay, so uh, this is yours to, uh, to decide. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go fetch me a beer. This oh, okay. is yours to, to decide on. Hmm. I mean, ask. <clears throat> Compare Prius models. Funny. My teenage fantasies are ruined. <clears throat> Share razors. Anyone happening upon us on the internet is like, what is happening right now? But, you know, here we are. I'm playing strange music. Answers are flying by. Who won? 
Oh, no one's won yet. I was just playing music. I see. To All fill right. the to fill the space. All right, let's see. <clears throat> Never clean the locker room. Yeah. <clears throat> Never make eye contact, I believe, was was really like uh -huh. and, and the the one thing that used to really freak me out wasn't the guys who would walk around butt naked. That's okay, fine. They would stand around for far too long being naked, making chit chat about, you know, fucking hey, Steelers, whatever is it Steelers Packers this weekend. It's the guys with the shirt and no pants. Oh my god. <laughs> that it's you, well, now listen, you, you fellas. Remember dating a girl, and you'd, she'd get up the next morning, and she'd, like, put on one of your shirts and, like, walk around, like, make breakfast, whatever, get coffee or whatever. Sexiest thing in the world does not apply to men. Does not. Does not. Does not apply to men. Men with <laughs> shirt and no pants is the most horrifying thing This was over more than one gym, right? Like, mm -hmm. this, is, this is how guys act at the gym. Uh, honest to God, I... Because I can assure you when women go to the gym, we change clothes and go work out and then go change clothes again. There have been some of the funniest responses possibly ever to a question uh, here. So I'm going to read some of these here. Inhale, says Christina. Drop your soap, certainly. Uh, disco, don't disco. Uh, let's see. Don't masturbate in, 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 the, in the locker room, Heather. Take a nap. Uh, don't be Captain Morgan, says Eric. I don't know what that means. So I was already going to give it to Eric for don't ask for doctor's <laughs> advice at the gym. <laughs> Captain Morgan, take the train, chit chat, make new friends, ask someone to hold your package, share razors. Uh, let's see, uh, my teenage fantasies are ruined. Uh, the compare Prius models, get doctor's advice, get out the yard, yard stick, nap, show people your family photos. Uh, let's see, whip out. <laughs> that one made me laugh out loud too. Heather says, whip out a saxophone. Whip out a saxophone. <laughs> Oh, the visual. Oh, my goodness. Oh, this is, so, so who did you... Uh, oh, don't waffle stomp, says Carrie. Absolutely not. Who, uh, I'm going to give it to Heather for whip out a second. Oh, my God. I broke a little sweat there, Heather. That was phenomenal. Yeah. Heather's been... Heather's been waiting for this moment. This is her moment. Okay. By the way, where is your cousin? Where is he your was, cousin, he, Scott? He got up at 4 a.m. when he was in Greece to come see the show, which was canceled. <laughs> then he came yeah. last week when it was tech-filled, glitchy <laughs> spazness. <laughs> and now he's not here, and it's fine. We're fine. <laughs> glitchy spaz. Oh, I'm canceled. You're not supposed to say spaz. <laughs> oh, everything uh -oh. is cracking me up tonight. Everything is free time. Well, I guess I'll have to eat this whole blank all by myself. <laughs> Well, doggone it. It's just me and I ordered it. Here I am at the Shoney's. <laughs> I guess I'm going to have to eat this whole blank all by myself. Yeah. We drove cross country a couple times and stopped at the Big Texan in El Paso, Texas. Is it El Paso? I think it's El Paso. It's Amarillo? Amarillo. 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 Thank you. Amarillo. Amarillo. And that's the place where if you can eat yeah. the 72-ounce 72, 72 steak, um, you get it free. You can eat it within an hour. And you, Put you up on a you stage. You can't eat it. Uh, the whole thing. I oh, could you have to eat the side dishes too. You gotta eat the like, side you're dishes gonna too. You're gonna make yourself sick. Oh, sure. No, don't fill up on side dishes. Yeah. So, anyway, uh, I. <laughs> <laughs> what do we got? Eric Atwood. <laughs> <laughs> oh God! <laughs> Is this my round? I can't say yeah. that. Okay, so it, it, I have to eat this whole story by myself. This whole <laughs> thing. My mom says, "Dilda sausage unwanted." Oh boy, Eric says one cup. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, yes he does. Wow. Spotted dick. <laughs> uh, twaffle. Crow, oh, twaffles. Yeah, Kathy knows uh, twaffles. Twaffles. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Twaffles? Mm -hmm. Try them. Try them. So anyway, uh, I think the, the bear hole, got to eat the whole bear hole. Um, I think that the key to eating the 72-ounce steak is you just eat a ton in the days prior before you're going to do it. Just stretch that stomach way out. And then the day of, you only drink water. I didn't prepare. Didn't even know we are going to stop by. Saw this big old corn-fed fella in sitting in the... Uh, on the, you know, the dais, as it were, eating thing. He was going to make it. You're going to make yourself He's sick make just it. from nerves, from yep. trying to eat that in front of all those people in one hour. It's, just, it's not worth it. You're yep. going to get so sick. Well, Eric has certainly won this round. <laughs> 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 That's a terrible, terrible visual. And uh, yeah, I just, <laughs> we'll just, we're just going to say you want to leave it alone. How about that? <laughs> Why are you all so funny? Oh, you people. You say blank like it's a bad thing. You say blank like it's a bad thing. <laughs> My dad actually can eat an entire pie in one sitting. Yeah, he can do that. He can do that. Mm. And, and likes to. Does your dad like pumpkin spice latte? I don't believe he does. Dad, do you? Yeah. Tell us, do you? I, I don't I'm think wondering. he does. Because you love pumpkin pie. I don't think he likes anything fucking with his coffee, honestly. I think he he's, he's, takes it uh, takes it black like, uh, l like his goth clothing. Oh, boy. Sure, why not? I'll turn you all into gods mm -hmm. eventually. Mm -hmm. 
You say golden shower like it's a bad thing. <laughs> Scotty. Nice. You say all alone like it's a bad thing. <laughs> Retirement? Uh, my dad says no. He's <laughs> not into the pumpkin spice latte oh. at all. You say fuck me like it's a bad thing. Oh, boy. Mansplain. Like it's a bad Nug. thing. Nug. Penis wrinkle. Don't they all? I mean, the only time when they don't is... <laughs> It's the locked hours of, of the day, let's say, you know, right? When you... Uh, Is yeah. that true even of an uncircumcised person? Have to ask somebody who has one. <laughs> you know? Don't know. We here in the United States tend to snip. We do. You say shaving your balls in the locker room like it's a bad thing. I uh, but I stayed at, when, you know, I went to a boarding school, and during a time when I was doing a production of a show there that was requiring me to stay at all hours, uh, my parents said, well, just go ahead and board there. So I boarded there for uh, about, um, I don't know, was it like uh, three months, something like that? You did? Yeah, yeah. I've and, never heard uh, this. And, uh, you know, the open showers, and it was the first time I'd ever seen anything like, whoa, that's uh, okay. Well, ne- never seen anything like that before. Very, very strange. It's like a hooded something or other. Like and, a sharp hate dog. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, just like, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All uh, tucked under like that. Not, that. not that there's anything wrong with that. <laughs> you say Lindsey Graham like Lindsey Graham like a bad, uh, <laughs> bad. multiple stab wounds, says Heather. Blocked. Shaving your balls in the locker room. Three inches. Yeah, these are these are great. Gonorrhea. You have a smooth deck, says Kathy. Yes, we do. I have a, the smoothest deck around. And we have Eric to thank for. We have Eric to thank for our very, very smooth deck. Who had the funniest mm-hmm. response on this one, dear Laurel? Is it me? Because I'm mm-hmm. giving it to Carrie for it. You say shaving your balls in the locker room sure. like it's a bad thing. Right, 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 right. Yeah. Like it's a thing not everybody does. All right. Like, come on. Who come on. Hasn't? Who among us? Who among us is, has not shaved our genitalia in an, in an open public space? The right? thing is, I there's this whole like stuff that goes on in a men's locker room versus stuff that goes on in a women's locker room, which is nothing. Right, like women don't stand around naked talking to each other. That's a damn shame. Sorry, everyone. But Sorry, but, the, but, the, but don't disabuse but fellas why, of that because we, we like that. Why does so head. much go on in the men's locker room? I don't know because men like to just stand around and I, I, I honestly with their I balls don't, hanging out. I guess I why? don't get it. I don't in front of it. other guys. I don't get it. I don't get okay. it. Never gonna. The newest additions to the Super Friends, the Super Friends. Batman, Robin, Wonder Woman, Aquaman, some others, uh, and also Blank Man and Blank Woman. The newest additions to Super Friends, Blank Man and Blank Woman. Yeah. So we're going to have some new Super Friends here tonight. Going to anoint them. I will even read them in my best Don Pardo impression voice. He's the guy who did the uh, the narration on the Super Friends. Do you know that? I did not know that. Don Pardo, the guy who, of course, was the voice of Saturday Night Live. It's Saturday Night Live. Was also, meanwhile, in Gotham City. That was, uh, that was old Don Pardo. Long Wait, and your mom word. says <coughs> the women women do, old women do, some do, talk to each other yeah. naked. Yeah. Right. yeah, I haven't been to a gym in a long time. My mom did used to go to the, the, the YMCA, <laughs> and you, you did tell that there were, there were women who would stand around and just kind of, uh, yeah. In, in the altogether, but never the people you just want. Just being nude. Never. The, it's the same principle. I, I am it. certain. Same principle when it comes to like nude beaches and things like that. It's never the people you want to see naked, right? They're, they're never like you know, people just bodies you could bounce a fucking nickel off of just standing well, around. Well, those are never flexing. the people that go to like a nudist colony either, right? That's what it does. Yeah, oh, pre- is that what you're? I, yeah, exactly I thought you right. were talking about uh, locker rooms. Uh, no, I mean people. People go to locker rooms. People go to gyms in order to become more like the person that you would want to see. Uh, ideally, yeah, no, we were, we were always like a, a nude beach or whatever, a locker room or yeah. Yeah, Kent man and Mercer Island woman. You have to be a Washingtonian to get that. Uh, yeah. Good. Uh, let's see, quiet man and nasty woman. Uh, she man and he woman. <laughs> okay, all right, sure. All right. <laughs> Empathetic water man water. and tired woman. <laughs> 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 oh, Kathy Brown Evangelista. She's so funny. Kathy Brown Evangelista, Evangelista, Evangelista. Diddly, diddly, diddly. This is yours too, side, by the way. Oh, it is. I'm just, I'm just watching them go. Gigging and here. jigging, you are. <sighs> I'm not going to do live events anymore, guys. I, I finally, I've, I've you just. I doing this event tomorrow. You mean like for, this one, this this live this event. Very live I'm event. not no, going to no. do this anymore. I'm no, out of no. here. No, no, no. It's it's the live events that are stressing me out. I'm doing this event, uh, and I'm it's I'm I'm proud to do it. It's it's for this charity. 
uh, but I am uh, I am as, as freaked out about it as I always am, and I'm basically just sitting here nervously vibrating in my seat, anticipating tomorrow night. Going, <laughs> so I'm kind of nervous. Not doing this anymore. But it's just like a medium. Like it's no big deal of it, right? Or it's I mean, it's not no big deal of it, but it's like you know nobody's gonna get mad if you're nervous. No, 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 no. It's not like that. I mean, I'm not even getting paid. I'm volunteering to do it. Uh, the dead man and happy woman. Oh, Eric, uh, that's rough. <laughs> it's dark. Daddy issues man and Oedipus woman. Sexy uh, man and drunk woman. Oh boy. No. Sterile man and pleasured woman. Well, you have a lot to choose from here. Uh, socks with sandals man and walla walla wine woman. Is that what <laughs> you're going with? Uh, no, I'm just reading them out. As as well you should. <laughs> as well you should. Uh, let's see. Hmm. I'll take Daddy Issues Man and Oedipus Woman. I like it. I like it very much. And that goes to a school Greek theater throwback. Heather Coach, nicely done. Yes, really, the way to our heart, uh, Heather, is, is to make uh, some sort of comment that panders to our um, occasionally quite useless, uh, <laughs> large, largely quite useless uh, theater training. Yeah. Wow, that was close. My whole blank flashed before my eyes. You know the story. You know how it goes. Wow, that was close. My whole blank just flashed before my eyes. Apparently that really does happen. Your life flashes before your eyes. For your, if you're, uh, if you have a, a near death experience, I am told. Haven't had one. Although I have been in a car with Jack Meyenberg. Holy God! <laughs> Don't do it. He's fine now. He's he's fine now. He actually he, he actually drives very very conservatively. Who is with those little kids? Man. I think so. Yeah. Do do that was close. My whole blank just flashed before my eyes. Wow! Wow! Bow, 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 bow. My, my whole white <laughs> my mom says my whole white ass just flashed before my eyes. That is very very funny. Crippling deaths, <laughs> negative account balance. Okay, so we have a two factor authentication. <laughs> oh, you people! Freshly you, shaved balls. <laughs> you, you're gonna make this tough on me, aren't you? You make this one tough. I, I love how this is like one long improv game that has to do is. with. Oh, it's whatever been going on for two and a half years yeah, now. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> Kathy says her whole Kegel routine has flashed before her eyes. Yes, indeed. Yep. Mm, 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 mm. Kegel eggs. Are those still a thing? Is that a thing? Oh, like Gwyneth Paltrow's goop Kegel egg? A goop Kegel egg. <laughs> Is that a thing? It's a goop, goop egg. Goop, okay. goop. Robert Siegel used to be a, uh, a newscaster on NPR, and he had a very strange uh, uh, speech affectation in which he would <laughs> Robert Siegel, and he would say things like, uh, like the, uh, Google the Glass. So, yeah, when he, yeah, he would report on, remember when Google Glass was a thing? And he was reporting. Uh, remember when that the, was the next big thing? Exactly. And, and it's like, the, the new, let's see if I can do this. Uh, I'm Robert Siegel. The newest innovation, Google Glass. <laughs> uh, yeah, so, right. Google. Eric said, uh, my whole job history at Lori's. <laughs> it's been eight years, Eric. And I don't know if you saw the very beginning of the, the gathering here where we were talking about how you start you know, out going, I just want the grass to be greener. Mission right? creep. Oh, my Mission God. Creep. That's what happened with the, uh, the gym downstairs. We were yeah. just like, I just want to fix this wall. And then, like, four months goes by. And yeah. Eric's like, I live here now. Yeah, they are basically. We, we, like, we got a cot. Yeah, Eric's like, you've watched my children grow up. Like, that's how many years I've been working here. <laughs> oh, my I God. just want this one thing. Well, that'll be four months. So, listen, uh, there have been a f I, I got to read some of these before I anoint the winner on this one. Uh, so, two factor authentication was, was great. Crippling debt, phenomenal. Negative about, uh, account balance from Kathy. Kegel routine. The full Monty, says Christina. Uh, Brazilian wax remnants, says Kathy. Search history, says Christina. Uh, let's see. Four inch grass strips, says Kathy. Lifetime of bad decisions, says Heather. But I'm going to give it to my mom for white ass. Yes. <laughs> Very, very funny. Oh my gosh, Seamus went to college. <gasps> oh my good, Seamus went to okay? college. Are you guys okay? You guys, you guys doing okay? Are you guys okay? You coming over for Jello shots later? Yeah. Are you? Uh, you're half halfway to being empty nesters now. Mm -hmm. Are you okay? Oh lord. Would Yikes. was uh, did anyone cry? What would, I'm sure did there were he tears. Cry? <laughs> I'm, no, I'm, I'm he sure did there not. Were, he's like bye. He's like bye. <laughs> and you guys are like. Rear view, smaller. Bye. <laughs> 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 They're okay. They say, okay. Good. If I were a dinosaur. I'd be a Blankosaurus. If I were a dinosaur, I'd be a Blankosaurus. Wait, who won that round? My mom. Okay, sorry. 
<laughs> White ass. <laughs> nice of them, mom. If I was overly focused on the uh, dropping the kids off. Nice of them. Nice of them. Uh, if I were a dinosaur, I would be a blankosaurus. Kathy says, for me, freshman year of college was fine. It was sophomore year drop off that did me in. I, I wonder why. What what the, the difference? Uh, the difference made there uh, between those those two years. In where we went to school, freshman year, you would live uh, on campus, and then after that, you would get your own apartment. Maybe that was the difference. Uh, pre menopausosaurus. <laughs> oh, boy. The worst. This one's going to be yours, babe. The worst. Mm-hmm. Perry menopausosaurus. Yeah. I put a saurus. Yep. I don't know why. Uh, that's because I said that. Yeah, you did. Yep. Smart assosaurus, says Christina. I like that. Oh, that, oh, yeah. So he's not coming back home. Sure. Yeah. Smart as Sasaurus. Smart as Sasaurus. But you're not really, Christina. You're not a smart ass. I've never known you to be a smart ass at all. Uh, uh, Carrie says, Apple Sasaurus. Uh, nut Hugger Saurus, says Eric. Not a, not a huge Saurus. A Thesaurus, says Carrie. <laughs> <laughs> a Karenosaurus. My dad would be a Titosaurus. That was that, that's what he would be. A Titosaurus. I'd be a sassy saurus. A fuck off asaurus, yeah. says my dad. It's funny when you read that, Dad, it looks like you're just telling us to fuck off. Yeah. <laughs> it the comment it literally just says fuck off. Yeah. Okay. Like, all right. <laughs> I don't know. Well, I guess we did something to deserve that. Kathy'd oh. be a shivasaurus. A shivasaurus, she would. She'd she would shiv. absolutely be. Yeah. She would just yeah. Cut a Theosaurus. Mm. A Cirrosaurus. I like that. Uh, Stonersaurus. Mm-hmm. Mm. Cirrosaurus. A Cirrosaurus. That's fun to say. Thick thing. Thick thighsaurus. Thick thighsaurus. Stonersaurus. Up the ass. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. It's yours to judge, dear I'm Laura. I'm gonna go with uh, Carrie with a thesaurus. A thesaurus. Yeah, I was gonna say <laughs> a very elegant answer. Very elegant answer. I actually, the first time I saw the thesaurus. Uh, on a shelf, I was like, is that about a dinosaur? I, 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 thought, I thought exactly that. There you go. <laughs> Kathy said procrastinosaurus, and I was listening to this uh, self-motivational YouTube video, whatever. I, sometimes yeah. in the morning, I need motivation. So I go to a YouTube video. Sure. This guy was giving this lecture about how procrastination means your subconscious mind thinks, no, I don't like your plan, and it's not going to work, so I'm not going to do it. <laughs> like, That's fair. That's rough. I, and, and so you're supposed to like call yourself, go like, hey, hey, I'm the one that's in charge of this plan. You don't get to second guess my plan. I just get bored. I think that's <laughs> honestly my ADHD problem. It's like if I'm not into something and into it all the way, check out, I'm not here. I don't know. That's inattentive ADHD. Yeah, well, hi. Very nice to meet you. I'm yeah. Stefan. You're only like into the thing you're looking at. Oh, God, I got to just... Oh, are we still doing the show? I'm yeah, so sorry. exactly. <laughs> That's exact. That Har, exact Har. You see what I did there? <laughs> see what I did there? So my, uh, my subconscious mind pretty much hates all of my life plans. <laughs> <laughs> I was totally into him, totally into him, until he texted me a photo of his blank. I was totally into him until he texted me a photo of his blank. Why am I not writing these? The, the, I feel like this, this is a reboot show from the 1970s. Where the, you know, like the newlywed game, or like making whoopee or something or other, would be, you know, the euphemism. It should be hosted by Bob Eubanks or some shit. I was totally into him until he texted me a photo of his blank. blank. Also, I have a question. Maga hat. Grades. Why, <laughs> did, why did college drop off happen on Friday? Like, yeah, what was doesn't up with it that? usually happen like on a Monday? <laughs> Seen as this only <laughs> only fans page. <laughs> oh God, I I was blissfully unaware of what OnlyFans uh, was until about six months ago, and uh, now I, I I I I'm not entirely sure I'm all the richer for knowing what OnlyFans is. What I mean, I know what it is, but like, what can regular people do it, or is it? That's just exactly for what it is. Or it's for celebrities. Is it? I thought it was for regular folks who like to do a little porn on the side. No, it's because celebrities will do it too. Like like mm. YouTubers or whatever, like, oh, I have an OnlyFans now. Like they charge you for naked photos of themselves. Oh, Lordy. I don't know. What what an economy we become. Honestly, we, we, we get the culture we deserve. 
Do we not? <laughs> Until he texted me a photo of his wife. Of his teen <laughs> bride, says Eric. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> of his saxophone, says Of his Kat. pillow. Of his gym locker room. That's a good callback, Carrie. I like that. Uh, As no one said his shaved balls, because I'm shocked if that, if that doesn't come up. <laughs> My mom says his face, body, and personality. Yeah, yeah. He was he was hot. Otherwise. All those things. Yeah. Uh, let's see. LinkedIn profile. Yeah. That's still a thing. Pee Wee Herman collection. I don't know if you guys are morbid like us, but every once in a while, you I'll are be like, though. hey, but you are, though. If, if anything, God forbid, should ever happen to me, mm-hmm. are you going to go on dates? Are you going to, like, swipe right on some people? Like, what are you going to do? Are we are we having this discussion here for real? No, I'm just saying, like, uh, we, like we've, we've had this discussion before, and he's like, no, I would never go on a dating app. Would you go on it? You wouldn't go on a date. No, but I understand why people do. I mean, it helps you match up. You know, it, it basically is increasing the odds that you're going to get along with the person because at the very least, you know, hey, we both like the Steelers. Boop. <laughs> so, you know, I get why. It's, it makes. I've heard it's awful. I've, I've, heard, I've heard dating is awful. So there you go. Yeah. Uh, Elon Musk Shrine. Carrie had a, a couple of really fucking funny answers. So uh, I want to read them for you. Uh, uh, Jim, <laughs> Jim Locker Room I thought was extremely funny uh, also Elon Musk Shrine was very funny and Carpet so all those <laughs> yeah David Salter's answer made me laugh out loud and the last and the last round too so. <laughs> oh god, god Eric Jesus H Christ no that's that's, that's horrifying I'm giving it to Kerry no okay. yeah nice one <laughs> me dee 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 so uh, you know me this is a an old Homer Simpson quote uh, you know me, I like my blank hot and my blank cold. You know me, I like my blank hot and my blank cold. You know, I don't know. Do you like hot and what do you like cold? I like my coffee hot and my ice cream cold. There you go. Perfect. Okay. An innocuous, perfectly <laughs> innocuous, a demonstration answer, if you will. Money, money. I like spot. my money hot and my money cold, yeah. says Christina. Yeah. Yeah, I did. I threw you under the bus yeah, there. I'm sorry. Did. I did. Wait, we have a, we have a rule here. Never do that. Yeah. You want to stay married? Don't do that. Always, uh, always say yes. I like my blood hot and my heart cold. Says Kathy. Nice. We are always yes handing. Spoken here, right? like the shiv. Here on the only show and here on the uh, the, the the marriage between Laurel and Stefan. Always. My, my Frank hot and my beans cold. Yeah. Yeah, I like Franks that. Franks and beans. Yeah, Franks and beans. Good. Mm. I'd like someone to work shaved balls into every answer. Absolutely. I'd yeah. like my ball razor hot and my shaved balls cold. Holy God. <laughs> yeah. Wait, then they'd be smaller and you could shave Say them. Say no more because you're judging this round. Okay. So, uh, Kathy says, you know me, I'm, I like my sex hot and my relationship cold. Oh, bear hole and, bear hole and dildo. Uh, this fall on NBC. This fall on NBC. <laughs> <laughs> the, the, the buddy cop, uh, the, the buddy cop uh, series we've all been waiting for. Bear hole and dildo. And dildo. Yeah. Uh, oh boy, yeah, my my girl's hot and my cup cold. Uh, let's see, my my Frank hot and my beans cold. Boobs and boobs, just like sadly, boobs. not even the first two girls one cup reference in this game. This evening. Not even the no, first. No, 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 no. For those of you keeping score at home, and of course we are. Uh, who had the funniest response, dear Loro? One, two, three. I'm just can't, now. See, I'm trying to keep score as I'm keeping score, and it's not working. Oh wait, wait. I'm. Uh, You're the odd numbers. I'm the odd number. Okay, I have to yeah. judge this one. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Heather, I like my inappropriate yodeling hot and my sad hand job cold. You win. <laughs> Nicely done. Nicely done. Heather is on fire. That is very, very funny. Can't wait for fall, and you don't really have to because it's here. A snap in the air, pumpkin spice lattes, and blank. <laughs> Eric says he likes he likes his wife cold and his beer hot. <laughs> I think that's what he said. I don't remember. Mm-hmm. Can't wait for fall. It's here, kids. I wrote this card a while ago. Uh, a snap in the air, pumpkin spice, like PSLs. Uh, their aficionados apparently refer to them as. And blank. I can't see Heather. We'll read you Heather's response. Yeah. Yeah, because they're, they're, they're quite funny. Uh, my credit card. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Yeah. Can't wait for fall. A snap in the air, pumpkin spice, like, and half and four points is Heather. Okay. Seasonal, I suppose. Does it get better? Do, like when it gets colder, does 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 the foreplay become full last? Do we suppose or springtime? Springtime for full on foreplay. Fall for is the time you just full phone of it asses? in. Phoning it in for fall. Phoning in the, the foreplay for fall. That's almost a um, a, 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 an alliterism. Phoning in 
foreplay for fall. There you go. Three, uh, three and a roly poly little bat face girl. <laughs> oh, that's a Paul Simon reference. Nice with him. Uh, disappointed. <laughs> Oh, God. Pumpkin Spice Wet Dreams, uh, <laughs> says Heather. Uh, fantasies about the delivery drivers. Early, dark, long nights. Yes, indeed. Yeah, I, I can't see Christina's answers. I'll read them. I mean, I'm, some I'm, of them. I'm not entirely I, I sure. I saw that one. I'm not entirely sure. Why? I don't know the algorithms of anything. I don't anymore. either. Super spreader events. <laughs> but those aren't happening anymore, it's right? It's the season, though. It is the season. Yeah. Warm bodies, uh, says Eric. Uh, so, dear Loro, who had the funniest response to Can't Wait for Fall? This is your favorite time of year. Well, this in winter. Uh, snap in the air, pumpkin spice lattes, and blank. <laughs> depression. And depression, says <laughs> Kathy. Uh, well, let's see. <clears throat> Kathy made me laugh with uh, disappointed relatives and depression. So okay. we're going to get it. Good Kathy. Okay. Y'all. Stephen finally lets him sleep, as he re was reported earlier. All he had to do was blank. Stefan finally got some sleep. All he had to do was blank. A full blood transfusion. <laughs> it's like brain transplant, full blood transfusion. Yeah. Worked out, though. Sleeping like a baby now. Lobotomy. That was it. Bottle in front of me. They'd front of lobotomy. shocked at what you had to do. Oh, yeah. Shocked. It's it's the opposite of sad. Yeah. Hap. <laughs> you did have to stay up all night for two or three days. <laughs> I did close <laughs> did. his eyes. That was what I've been I've been doing that wrong the whole time, Kathy. Yeah. I haven't been just, closing my eyes when it's time to sleep. Just sitting there. Break out the jazz hands. <laughs> I did. And really, they'll wear you right out. The jazz hands. The Macarena. Prematurely ejaculate. Oh no, mature. Right on mature time, my brother. Mature ejaculate. Right on, brother. Drink more Tito's with my dad. Uh, fluff my pillow. Mm -hmm. That was it. Yeah. It, metaphorically speaking. Yeah. And, and literally. Yeah. Fluffing my pillow. Cry myself to sleep. Yeah. Yeah. In my huge pillow. This is you. Oh, it is. You're I watching. I know. Okay. Uh, say there's no place like home. That's true. I had the ability the whole time, Christina. The ability to sleep the whole time. Listen to the news. Well, that's just what I do when I want to get to... Uh, just uh, steadily to really. You know what I should anyway, not no. do when I wake up in the middle of the night? I should not start watching TikToks. I do. Because they're so engaging. They're so you know, engaging. It's like, Your brain and, just and then a half right an hour on. goes by, you're like, I learned nothing. I, I Oh, I, actually, I learned it. I'm watching, watching people dance with their children. That is fun. Uh, let's see. Tending Loro's car. <laughs> Boy. Uh, yeah, uh, can, oh, it's like my dad says counting titties. That's very nice. Like counting sheep, just counting titties. They come in twos. Yeah, like, mature. Yeah. <laughs> Gave up public speaking. <laughs> that's going to get it. That's, that's, a, that's the answer. That's the answer to beat, I think. Now, let's see. Start my OnlyFans page this year. <laughs> uh, <laughs> what would you do on an OnlyFans page? Oh, puppet shows. <laughs> <laughs> penis puppet shows? I, mm, I don't know. There was a show in New York called The Puppetry of the Penis. I cannot imagine how that must have been comfortable for those guys doing that every night with their dongs. It's like, Rawr. Damn. Uh, get that damn deck finished. Uh, negotiate an hourly rate. Call Eric Atwood. Uh, because I think uh, as Kathy had it first, uh, Terry's answer was really funny, but Kathy's came first. Give up public speaking. I'm giving it to, <laughs> to Kathy. Nice them. What round are we on, dear Laura? This is round 14. 14. 14. Okay. Now, uh, <clears throat> you guys know that uh, uh, NASA has had to scrub a number of its missions. And by the way, you really don't get to use scrub in uh, in, in, in verb form uh, like that unless you're referring to NASA. <laughs> so I thought I'll take full advantage <clears throat> tonight. Just announced NASA will launch a manned flight to blank. Just announced NASA, they're, they're just giving up on this whole moon thing. They're, 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 gonna go, they're, they're going past the moon now, kids. They're going to launch a manned flight to blank. <clears throat> I have phlegm. Just announced NASA will be launching a manned flight to blank. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Jeff Bezos, the, 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 yeah, exactly. Yeah, it would be, I, I believe, that the white hot core of Jeff Bezos' ego. He's still, <laughs> okay, good, yeah. I'm gonna put a man on East LA. <laughs> Carrie got it, okay, good, Carrie wins. Yeah, that was it. That, I was just waiting for that one answer. Carrie, <laughs> Carrie got it. We can stop Wait. playing now. 
So is this like a round of psychic uh, cards where <laughs> you're thinking of a word and someone just has to say it and then they get a point? As far as I'm concerned, yes. You, uh, However, it is your end to judge. The so. password is Uranus. <laughs> <laughs> Watch a man fly to Uranus. <laughs> of course that's what get. Of course. Of course that's the winner. Okay, so The password is balls. So uh, we are on to the tie-breaking round, I believe, and I'll bet you that it is between Carrie... Heather and Kathy. Am I that right? That is who is this? Oh, I'm good. How do oh, you know I am that? good. I'm very, very good. Wait, is the tiebreaker round 14 or 15? Because it's only been two and a half years we've been playing this oh, game. Oh, no. That, that, was, that was round 14? Then we're doing round 15. Okay. Uh -huh. So there you go. So, so Carrie won uh, round uh, 14. You remember the... Uh, we some... don't keep score anymore. Yeah, we do, though. The science fiction film Ma uh, Mars Needs Women. Well, they need something else now. Mars Needs Blank. Mars needs blank. TP for their bunghole. I think if you were to watch uh, uh, old episodes. So, okay, of, so how does this work? Should I think of an answer? And then, <laughs> yes, exactly. And when it comes up. And then when it comes up, that person no, gets that a person point. person gets okay. a point. Yeah, exactly. So let's, let's do this. Okay. Read mind. It's time to play Read Laura's Mind. You guys all know what I'm thinking, right? Read, read Laura's mind. Time to read Laura's mind. It's time to play a game we call to read Laura's mind. You cannot be that far behind because when you do, you're gonna read it and you're gonna win. Bow, yeah. A bar. <laughs> that, that, my dad's a bar. That's, that's good. Yeah. yeah. Kathy said that, too. Magic of live theater. <laughs> this, this is Heather. Uh, Laura's Lawn. It needs Laura's Lawn. Yeah. The password is... It needs firemen. It needs fire hoses. Very cold there on Mars, apparently. Yeah. Keep seeing uh, footage of it. Um, it looks... Um, it looks an awful lot like the desert. I have to say, it just it, it does. It, it looks like the footage that I've seen. It's like gray skies and uh, yeah, just just outside of Los Angeles. Like, but but like not your dead desert, but like Banning, right? That's that's what it looks like. Mars looks Banning. Uh, my 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 uh, my desert too looks like that. No, yeah. it looks space like. Uh, Patagonia. Oh, Fed, the, you know, thank you to the, um, he's watching, of course, uh, the owner of Patagonia for donating his $3 billion company. Oh my goodness. What a commitment donating it all to climate causes. What a minch. What a fucking minch, man. I love that. So Laura, who had the funniest response to Mars blank provided that nobody uh, read your mind? I was waiting for someone to say clowns. Oh yes. Okay. <laughs> that, that is funny. Right. Clowns. But short of that, who had the funniest oh, response? Oh, Carrie, they saw Patagonia. Oh, very cool. Mm, uh, new, uh, let's see. I've been <laughs> Eric. <laughs> That's true. Uh, Jim Cox wins with Eric. Yes. Mars, Mars needs, needs Eric. Eric. <laughs> okay, now we are on to the, the tie-breaking round. Okay, correct? Yes, between Kathy, Carrie, and Heather. Pulling out a special card for this. Okay. No go. one said clowns. Nobody said clowns. Mars needs clowns. Yeah, huh? <laughs> and I'm shocked because yeah. if you read my mind, clowns are always the first thing in my mind. It's true. Always thinking of that. Since he's going to Mars, you know what? I would, I would bet. Uh, I, I would bet on that. I bet that he's going to Mars. That's a, that, that is a statistical certainty. Uh, whenever, okay. So this is between Harry. <laughs> Kathy says that's because no place needs clowns. No. That's not true. Well, that's not the question. The question was, what am I thinking? <laughs> and I'm usually thinking of clowns. So this is uh, between Kathy, Carrie, and... Uh, Heather. And Heather. Okay, here you go. Uh, you all three answer this, and we will vote on a, uh, a winner. Whenever I feel nostalgic, I like to blank and reminisce. Oh, whenever I feel nostalgic, which is often, <clears throat> I like to blank and reminisce. Ever get caught in an old box? You're like moving stuff and you get caught in like an old shoebox full of letters from like oh, a, And then you're like stabbed with pangs of regret. Like, oh God, I was such an idiot. I was such an asshole to oh, that God. person or whatever. I yeah. was so stupid. Yeah, yeah. How naive. Yeah. No, I don't go into shoeboxes of letters for that very reason. <laughs> I feel 
I have this in common with Kathy. Every <laughs> once in a while, I have a memory of myself being an idiot, and I'm like, oh, oh, God, yeah, it I almost fix. feels I yeah. visceral. Like, I, uh, oh, my God, I feel I know. I know. sad and stressed out by it. Like, I I go, it's like I'm being electrically shocked. Like, yeah. oh, I know. oh, God. I know. What yep. an idiot. I, there are times when I will be, <laughs> like, just sitting <laughs> quietly by myself, and all of a sudden, a, a a memory will come uh, just flooding into my head of something that I did that was so unbelievably stupid, and I will want to stab a pencil in my ear and just go, <laughs> stop it. But do you audibly go, oh, oh, God. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah. God. Yeah, no, I, I wince. Oh, God. I mean, I, I absolutely wince. Yeah, I was like, oh, hi, oh, hi. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> Eric has mentioned uh, an experience that we had last week at the State Fair where we all saw a mime. <laughs> and I was yeah. like, you guys, there's a mime. Mimes are sadness for pay, are they not? I was like, we have to get out of here because that mime is going to see us and follow us. But he was trapped in a box, so he couldn't follow us. So uh, Carrie is, is the first in. Uh, she says whenever she feels nostalgic, she likes to jiggle Eric's face. All right. Obsess over my life choices and reminiscences, Gabby. Okay, yeah. <clears throat> so whenever I feel nostalgic, I like to either jiggle Eric's face, uh, hold, uh, let's obsess over my life's choices, says Kathy. <laughs> Christina says, hold my favorite party clothes from 1992. I was around then. Just hold them? I remember those party clothes, my friend. Drink. <laughs> Eric, <laughs> yeah. Oh, God, oh, God, Jesus Christ, Mom. Jan Cox says, shave my balls. Oh, boy. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> That's a funny fucking answer. That's the way to end the evening. <laughs> wow. My mom just might have had a walk-off there. I don't know. That was unbelievable. Janice Cox comes the out of... The password was, shave my balls. Janice Cox comes out of nowhere on the final round with a phenomenal... Just wallops. She wallops the ball, is what she did. Uh, fuck it. Oh, boy. So, when Heather has an answer that... Um, I guess I'm going to have to read since you all can't uh, see Heather's answers. Uh, fucking my cousin's friends, oh, says Heather. Okay. Yeah. okay. That and would be very nostalgic Scott too. Coates' friends. I would imagine so. Yeah. So here we go. Uh, let's 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 start to vote. Uh, we're voting between uh, Heather. And if you can't see Heather, just say Heather. <laughs> or um, uh, we've got uh, Kathy with the test over my And no choices. one see Heather except Kathy or can everyone see Heather? Not sure. And then Carrie says, jiggle Eric's face. Begin voting now. Begin voting now. <laughs> Yeah, watch out, Jim. It says Kathy. Exactly. Shaving up my dad. Oh, God. That's, that's, that, that is a horrifying image. Jesus. I know that they cut each other's hair, but Jesus. That is just, do they cut each other's they hair They do. Still? It's cute. It's very cute. Yeah. Kathy He's, can't see Heather anymore. Well, Heather is here, Kathy. We we, we, we can... We, she's like Snuffleupagus. We can, she's we can, invisible, but we, we'll validate her. We can assure you. And if you want to vote but for... But now I see her. If you want to vote for Heather... Uh, why just simply just say Heather, say Heather if, if you want to. She comes and goes. Heather comes and goes, <laughs> uh, according to Kathy. Yeah. Just playing the song while people vote. Oh, yeah. Playing the song while people vote. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and I've got that one sticky key. I don't know why. It's that one there. I don't know why. Could unplug it, but if I unplug it, the whole goddamn uh, broadcast goes to shit. And then we'll have to start all over. <laughs> like it hasn't already. So, uh, let's see. <laughs> bell bottoms. Okay. Yeah, the cat, th that's very funny. Heather says she comes and goes like bell bottoms. Nicely done. Yeah. yeah. Like a trend. So, uh, bell bottoms. Bell bottoms. Bell bottoms. I believe it has been uh, one minute, uh, dear Laura, who are the, the most upvotes for whenever I feel nostalgic, I like to blank and reminisce. Uh, and let's uh, anoint this week's winner. <laughs> well, currently there's a tie between Kathy and your mom. <laughs> so, I don't know. Well, let's give it another second here. I don't know what to do. <laughs> give it, well, we'll just give it another second. There's a tie. Be <laughs> so there's a tie between Kathy and my mom. Upvote. And, somebody and else needs to vote. Somebody I, else I needs to vote. Know. Yeah. I don't know. My mom really <laughs> did come in with just a, a, a walk on there. That was unbelievable. Unbelievable <laughs> answer. Look at this. Isn't this cool? Whenever I play a chord, it, it'll tell you right here what chord I'm playing. So, for example, if I play a C minor, see, it's a C minor. If I just do like this, <laughs> just like, hey, look at that. That is a an A, 6, 7th, uh, a G, 6, 7th, major, 7th, 9, uh, 9 sharp. That's what that sounds like. How about that? A minor 7, B minor 7. Okay. Uh, have we resolved hmm. the problem? 
We have enough Oh, outfits. your mom just got another vote. Wow. Okay. Unbelievable. Dan Cox has walked in and stolen the round. And the game. And the game. Congratulations, Mom. Nicely done. You get you some go. kind of skeleton thing. Some sort of prize. Well, you yeah. get to... Uh, we have, skeleton on it. We were, yeah, you get a skeleton. And also, <laughs> we, we, we meant to give these away last week, these... Uh, Adulting adult stickers. Adulting stickers. That's so right. you got those coming for you. Seeing you tomorrow. My mom is coming uh, with me to this event that I'm uh, uh, seeing. Your uh, last live event. My last live event. you're quitting live events. Quitting them. <clears throat> Retiring the trophy. Does anyone have any announcements? Any announcements? Anything for the good of the order before we sign off for the night? <laughs> yeah. We're so glad to see you all again. Reading of last week's minutes. We missed two weeks ago. I know. Because what happened? Oh, I had a crick in my neck. Yes, you had a crick That's in your right. neck, and then and then last week was technical difficulties. That's right. We tried to be here <laughs> last <laughs> week. <laughs> didn't work. And then, yeah, and so then we, we we are reunited, and it feels so good. Does it not? It does. It does. Okay, so um, any any final words uh, from you, dear Laurel, before we go? <clears throat> your mom says, she's so damn rude, that woman. Who? I... Huh? <laughs> no, she was referring to it, it would follow up one of our comments and I, I maybe she was referring I'm guessing she meant herself. Love you too, Dad. I love you too, Dad. Uh, and uh, me. She she's so damn rude that oh she means her oh. from coming and walking off with the entire game. I Nicely get it. done. David Seltzer says, see you in the fall. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, next week, which will be next week. All right, kids. Uh, did, 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 well, we're glad to provide the fun and distraction. Uh, we missed you as well. Uh, we will see you guys next week. Uh, any any final words before we go? Oh, yes. Christina, we're so glad we came back, too. We, we missed you. We missed you as well. I, did, did you come? Christina came at the very end last week, right? Or she she came at the... Uh, like, Ra- Rapel came at the very end. The, yeah. Rapel Somebody, came, yeah, and he was like, hey, did I, did I miss a, mm-hmm. uh, a technical uh, a disaster? I'm like, I wouldn't say you missed it. No. No, no, no I wouldn't yeah. say you missed it. Also, Eric and Carrie are on our, our, they're on our, our, our deck right now. Are they? Yes. They probably are. They probably are. Let's go. go let's go see them. <laughs> Bye, kids. Love you guys. Bye.